think it might have something to do with the girl in the camp. So I apologise, but I'm going to do a runner from this town again. Not the girl in the camp, the girl in the caravan. So as you can see, they're being actually much more friendly to us. Yeah, at some point, I think you have to give that ring to that girl. There's a little subplot. Just a funny little thing. Involving her. Right, now to talk to Pyatt. Actually, no, we have to wait until daytime to talk to Pyatt. I would have made that mistake had I not gone down the well. No slowdown! No slowdown! Thank you, SSF. Come on, I'm running, running everywhere. My shoes go click de clack. Here we go. What is this? Bullshit! Okay, so now we have to go back to George's. This is this is one of this is probably the most annoying part of the game. This stupid little basically it, it just as you can tell it just it just reeks of giving us something to do. Oh look, there's a great big hole in the side. Yeah, so the first visit to George's was kind of like uh all right trust me things are about to get noise ah yes we need a level 3 laser rank to break those things We can actually enter, so let's enter. Looks like the ship from Independence Day on the green. Someone may already be in there. Uh oh. It's the Empire.
and that. In case you can't tell what it is, is the Guardian Dragon, the boss from Panzer Dragoon's Vine. That's that for Edge. Not a very smart lad. Perhaps you should have looked at the pictures before you tortured him. Oh yeah, he's badass. Tekok sen kantera, igai to kakure bashi ga atte na. Tekok ga yabai mono o hakutsu shita tte yu kara binjou shite mini kita masa. Omae ga yu to wa omoi mo shinagatta. Tateru ka? Mikake no wari ni wa daijoubu so da. Iku so! Iku te toko ni? Well, we've changed locations. <laughs> 